Hello and welcome to your mindfulness session for post-traumatic growth and resilience. Today's practice is all about remembering how important it is to simply practice letting go. Whatever you resist persists. So learning how to let go can really help you move into a more empowered and creative mindset a happier and healthier mindset. We all have the tendency to try and control things. While that may be a good thing in theory, it's not actually a very practical way to live. It can be difficult to feel happy when you are resisting life at every turn. When you constantly feel unhappy or restless, or express any other negative emotions, you're attracting more of that instead of what you really want. The practice of letting go can really help you shift your mindset and think more positively. Let's do that now. Go ahead and close your eyes. And start by breathing in deeply, in and out. Notice if your mind is focused or if it has been pulled away by extraneous thoughts. It's natural to have a wandering mind, so there is no need to judge or criticize yourself when this happens. Breathe in deeply and follow the breath as it moves through your body. And slowly exhale. Now just breathe at your own natural pace. Keeping the rhythm of your breathing natural and normal. The practice of letting go can literally set you free. We all tend to hold on to things we are comfortable with, even fear or doubt. Doing so can hold us back in so many ways. Practicing the art of letting go is emotionally freeing. For example, you can let go of fear. You can let go of anger. Or even let go of all of those expectations as to how you think your life should be. These expectations and emotions can have a huge impact on your happiness and well-being if you let them. So take a moment now to focus on something that you need to let go of. And keep in mind, this could be something big or something small. And imagine how free you will feel to let this thing go. Emotions like anger and resentment and guilt keep us tied to things like a lead anchor. Forgive yourself. Let it go. Have some faith that the universe loves you and supports you. Now, as you think about this thing, take a moment to tell the universe that you are ready to let go and let life flow. You 
can also try repeating a simple statement like, I let go and let life flow. Repeat that phrase in your mind and focus on how good it makes you feel. I let go and let life flow. Repeat that a few times. And make a commitment to let things go. Get up every day with the intention to let life flow. It can be fun adapting to life's unpredictability. Sometimes our biggest failures can lead to our biggest successes in life. It's a great way to live your life. Now ask yourself how you can use this approach in your life. Find one thing to be grateful for in a bad situation. If you can't think of something good, you can be grateful that you had the motivation to listen to this session so you can feel better about your life. There is always, always something to be grateful for. And imagine how good you could feel every day with this kind of light-hearted attitude. And once again, focus on something you need to let go of and what you want to replace it with. Let go of the need for judgment. Forgive yourself. Make a commitment to get up and live every day more consciously with the intention to live life with more peace, joy, and grace. And repeat the simple affirmation. I let go. I am free from any burdens of my past. This is my new truth and my ultimate 2.0 me. Take one more minute to breathe deeply in and out and let go of anything else that might be holding you back. Notice how much lighter you feel. Just keep picturing this energy releasing and feel the freedom and the power of letting go.
and bring yourself back into the room, gently opening the eyes. Welcome back.